So today we are planning to go for Dian Fossi hike. Very difficult ride in the car. Do they grow here? Yes. I feel now the hike started. Marcus lost his shoes in the mud. <laughs> we can see some gorillas on the hike. It would be next level experience. Volcano National Park, Rwanda, Africa. My God. This is the first time I have done this muddy trek in my life. Most exciting part is I did a trek in Africa. Now. Good morning from Rwanda. We are at the Amahoro guest house near to the Volcano National Park. So today uh, we are planning to go for Dian Fossi hike. The people who don't know uh, who was Dian Fossey? Just Google about her. She was an American zoologist and she worked for 18 years for her life. More than 18 years, but she lived with for 18 years in Volcano National Park for uh, study mountain gorillas. Her work is really, really great. And this is the guest house where we were staying. Pretty cool space, I would say. Get 
it's okay. I mean, for the people who are living yeah, here, every day it's a struggle. For us, it's a one-day thing. So that's fine. I'm at the starting point of Dian Fosse hike and uh, so basically it was very <laughs> uh, very difficult ride in the car the driver was saying this is like African massage because the road was yeah not good but I think it's good for the national park they are trying to extend it let me show you a few things from here Can I can I see this? Can I come here? Can I come here? Yeah, no problem. That's garlic. Garlic, right? Yeah. Garlic. I was thinking this is a garlic. Yeah. Yeah, I know that. But this is not very strong, I guess. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Not very strong. Mm. Do they grow here? Yes. And what is this? A parrot? Pirate room. Pirate room? Yeah. Is it to eat? No. Then what? No, it's. Then how do you use it? Mm, that is. Mm. Pirate room. Pirate room? Yeah. No eat, no, no. No eat. Then uh, seeds? Yes. Inside. Ah, in yes. Okay, okay, okay. Yeah. Got it. Mm. Mm. What's your name? My name is Fabian. Fabian Mohit. Nice, nice to meet you. Nice to meet you too. <laughs> you my friend. Yep. My friend. Nice to meet you. Same, same, same here. How are you awesome? So this is the car we came <laughs> pretty much big car <laughs> I always recommend to have some people to help you if you feel you are with the hands, these are the porters. You can carry your luggage and help you not to fall down. Normally it is ten dollars per porter. I heard only Maramuse for the good morning, I guess. Okay. <laughs> and hello also. <laughs> what she said, it's a pie restaurant. We make lots of things out of this flour. In America, we send the liquid of this flour, the spray, mm. in the clothes. The last product is called Pinefra. You, you come from? Jordan. Jordan? London. London? Ireland. Ireland. Yeah. Uh, it's a natural spray. Natural. It's not bad for the conservation. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I feel now the hike started. Let me show you. A little bit. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Then in front of the sand post, there are many things. Those are beehives. Oh, okay, beehives. These big problem. This that goes inside, yeah, we can help. Ah. Uh, Michael might be like because he thinks that this goes. We have partners yeah. who help to save the honey <coughs> in Europe, America. So these local people, they can benefit <laughs> lots of money. Mm -hmm. yeah. Very nice conservation. Yeah. 
It's working. We no longer have bushfires. Thank you. <laughs> oh, that was just the trailer. <laughs> that was the trailer. <laughs> yeah. Marcus lost his shoes in the mud. <laughs> it's very, very, very muddy. I mean, I have never ever walked in this kind of mud. Without sticks, it would be, I think, almost impossible for us. Well, so far so good. Uh, I hope we can see some gorillas on the hike. It would be next level experience, really. But yeah. Volcano National Park, Rwanda, Africa, my god. You should carry Potter with yourself. It's helpful sometimes. Or if you have a really good group, What? They did all really good. Really? Because this is a good state. We must have a break up for we are going to do. But I know you are tired. There is a small house there. We are going to sit. We eat something. Then we get a briefing. Then we make a tour of this place. Okay. Is okay? Mm -hmm. Yep. So we'll take a picture of this or we we'll take it when we're coming back. We don't know. <laughs> the first national park in Africa. In Africa. Yes. And then in 1959, a man called George Shala is the first person who came to study the gorillas, but he studied them in Congo, and then after one year, the project stopped. Finally, we are going down. <laughs> we just finished the trek. It was very, very hard, I would say, because uh, it was all muddy. <laughs> this is the first time I have done this muddy trek in my life. And my knees are hurting. We are hungry. We are having a. We are taking some food for the bus and we'll directly catch a bus from Musanze to Kigali and after reaching Kigali I just want to take a hot bath yeah but the most exciting part is I did a trek in Africa wow and this town Musanze is really really beautiful they have uh, lots of mountains uh, Bizoke, Kari Something, something, Kari, Kari Somi, uh, is okay, Kari, I forgot the name, uh, yeah, outside Kigali, uh, there you, 
you might see very poor people i think yesterday we saw someone a little girl who was taking out uh, some used bottles from the garbage and she was smelling them so i would say some kind of addiction